Russia's defense ministry on Thursday released footage showing a new prototype of the newest S-70 Okhotnik flying wing unmanned combat air vehicle at the assembly line at the Novosibirsk aviation plant. Russian Defense Minister Sergei Shoigu inspected the production of Su-34 fullback fighter bomber aircraft and a new assembly line of the Okhotnik meaning hunter in Russian stealth drones at the Novosibirsk aviation plant. Right now, the aircraft maker is carrying out plan work on the production of prototypes of the S-70 stealth drone within the framework of the Okhotnik program. We hope that by 2022 the work will be completed and we will be able to sign, as is now customary in the armed forces, a large long-term contract for drones, the Russian defense minister said at the meeting after the inspection. This is necessary so that the industry knows how to build its plans for the next 10 years so that it can order and complete with materials and other types of insuring. The S-70 Okotnik developed by the Sukhoi Design Bureau features stealth technology and the flying wing design and it lacks the tail, which reduces its radar signature. According to the data of open sources, the drone has a takeoff weight of 20 tons and can develop a speed of around 1,000 km per hour. The Okotnik heavy attack drone performed its debut flight on August 3, 2019. The flight lasted over 20 minutes under an operator's control. On September 27, 2019, the Okotnuk performed a flight together with a Su-57 fifth-generation fighter jet. The drone maneuvered in the air in the automated mode at an altitude of around 1,600 meters, and its flight lasted over 30 minutes. The Okotnik's design is based on the flying wing scheme and incorporates use of composite materials and stealth coatings, making the drone low observable in flight. It has a weight of about 20 tons and a wingspan around 65 feet or 20 meters. The drone is powered either by a single AL-31F turbofan, as used on the Sukhoi Su-27 fighter aircraft or by the improved AL-41F derivative installed on Su-35S fighters and Su-57 prototypes. Although the first prototype's exhaust nozzle was conventional and could increase the drone's radar signature, future upgrade could see improved exhaust as well as engine inlet as shown by a mock-up at the 2019 MOX International Aviation and Space Salon. On February 12, 2021, it was reported that three additional prototypes were under construction at the Novosibirsk Chikolov aviation plant, according to a source in the military industrial complex. The second model is a modified copy of the first prototype while the third and fourth prototypes will be identical to the serial production unit. The improvements will relate to the systems of onboard radio electronic equipment and structural elements of the airframe. The three additional prototypes should be ready for flight tests in 2022 and 2023. The source in the military industrial complex also said that the serial hunter will receive a standard flat nozzle to further reduce their thermal and radar signature. On February 28, 2021, it was reported that the Okotnik will be used aboard the future Project 23900 Ivan Rogov amphibious assault ships capable of carrying four Okotnuk drones, for reconnaissance and strike missions.